Welcome to San Diego. We are here at the 65th Annual American Society of Hematology Meeting, the premier international hematology event. Sylvester Comprehensive Cancer Center researchers are working together to make bold discoveries that advance blood cancer research. In addition to our science, we have Sylvester faculty serving on ASH committees. We also have many examples of Sylvester science. A phase two study developed and conducted at Sylvester showed significant complete responses to targeted monoclonal antibody-based therapy in patients with high-risk follicular lymphoma. My goal is to try to improve outcomes and eventually achieve long-term remissions in these patients, and ideally with only one treatment and patients have been, can be in remission for a long period of time and you don't need any more treatments. We are also presenting results of a phase one study evaluating the safety and tolerability of an oral small molecule bed inhibitor in patients with myeloid malignancies. It's using a totally new type of anti-cancer therapy, and it's just really exciting the hope that it brings to offer them a new therapy that is really unavailable anywhere else. We are also presenting results from an analysis of CIBMTR registry data focused on the efficacy of CAR T-cell infusions in patients with large B-cell lymphoma. CAR T-cells, when infused in complete remission, still work and have excellent safety signals. It's a very good um, start, but there's, there's still a lot of work to do. You will also hear about results from the U.S. Lymphoma CAR T-cell consortium on the five-year outcomes for patients with large B-cell lymphoma treated with CAR T-cells as standard of care. Before CAR-T, I think, I would say that patients where the disease no longer responded to chemo, they'd be in a situation where we're looking for anything to put the disease in remission. As we get you know, to five-year outcomes that we're reporting, we now have a very effective therapy, and it's about how do we maximize the amount of people we're curing, uh, get people to live better and live longer. Our team science approach also includes Sylvester researchers as author of the Quantum First Trial, a global study for AML patients with FLT3 ITD mutations. We've gotten increasingly good at defining the genetic underpinnings of cancers like acute myeloid leukemia, paying attention to what our patients describe as their experience going through that cancer. And I think we're getting better and better at truly assessing what's meaningful to patients. We are thrilled to hold Miami Nights again this year to celebrate the contributions of our faculty and to celebrate the incredible scientific community. I am inspired by the work presented every year at ASH. Thank you so much. <laughs>